Welcome back to Marriage Beyond the Veil. Well, Esther Pearl is, um, she's done a TED Talk and she's a specialist in infidelity. Okay. And she works with couples. She teaches people how to do that? <laughs> she works with couples who have dealt with infidelity okay. in the relationships. And one of the things that she says is that one of the challenges is we feel that one person should fulfill all our needs. You know, since so back in the day when people so got married. So that chases people into other people's arms? No, and she doesn't believe that either. She doesn't okay. believe that that really has anything to do with why people So why'd you bring that up? Well, I brought it up because I was wondering, you know, now with the way that marriage is, do you think that people go into a relationship thinking someone should fulfill all their needs? So their best friend, you know, so they're only their BFF. They, I, I, I really don't they're... think so. <laughs> maybe, maybe once upon a time. But I think now, um, if, if we look at the landscape, mm -hmm. people aren't even getting married anymore. That's n true. N not in large numbers. Mm -hmm. And even when they do, um, there is like, okay, well, we can try this, mm -hmm. but I don't really need you. Yeah. You know. Well, they're not. They're not and, 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 and when I say I don't really need you, right. of course that's coming from the perspective of you females. Well, I'm just being honest. Okay, we just talked about people what? dropping out of relationships around the holidays, so they don't have to give up. That was from the male perspective. But anyway, um, so you believe that people just aren't committed to anything and they're not trying to be in a relationship? I, I, I mean, but I I think there's some validity I don't, I don't, to what I don't, I don't she think, said. I don't think people are willing to do the work. Okay, I agree. In, in large numbers. I agree. Of course, there are those that, that are. Mm -hmm. But I, I think it, it seems like, okay, well, we're in a time where everything is about, like, if it's not fun, if it's not mm -hmm. enjoyable, I don't want to be bothered. Mm -hmm. You know, and that's just not the reality for marriage mm -hmm. or for life. But I believe that. And I really do believe this, that in most cases, I think people go into a relationship thinking that everything should be perfect. So the, the sex Maybe should that. be perfect. The person should be able to financially assist them. They should be able to glide through life without any bumps and bruises. You know, and, and the reality is there is no one person that can do everything for you. I mean, in that respect. Because I think if but that why, was the case... Why, why would you want someone? To have to do everything for you. Or be everything to you. Okay. As well. You see what I'm saying? Because. And if that's your mindset, you're just setting yourself up for disappointment and failure. Mm -hmm. Because as you stated, nobody can be everything that you want and or need. Right. You have to know I'm responsible. You know, that, that whole <laughs> Jerry Maguire, you complete me. No. <laughs> You need to come complete it. You mean I didn't complete you? No. <laughs> no. I, look, I'm still fractured. <laughs> um, but, I mean, you have to come as a complete person. Yeah. You, you know, and if you're looking for somebody to be like, okay, the missing part of you. Right. That's just not reality. No, it isn't. You have to come as a whole person. And they have to come as a whole, whole person. person. Yeah. Now keep in mind, both of you are wholly flawed, right? Very good. Mm -hmm. But um, if, if you're looking for somebody to complete you, then no, you're not ready for a love relationship, much less marriage. Agreed. So because you don't know who you are. No, you don't. And that's another one of the challenges. When you don't know who you are, you don't know what you want mm -hmm. or where you're headed. And if you don't know what you want, anything looks like it, right? That's true. If you don't know where you're going, any road can get you there. Mm -hmm. I agree. Yeah. I agree. So. so, getting back to your infidelity specialist. Mm -hmm. Well, just saying, I don't believe that any one person can be everything for someone. And if you're going into a relationship thinking that, yeah, you're definitely headed for failure in that relationship. What say ye? We want to hear your comments. Do you think one is able to be everything? You complete me. <laughs> or do you think... What do you think? Let us know. We want to hear from you. Until tomorrow. Have Until a tomorrow good evening.